Hello everybody and very good evening. Welcome to the Clay's YouTube online classes. Tonight we're gonna have two more classes for you and we're gonna start with 40 minute chair workout. And after that we're gonna have 40 minute easy jazz class as well. All right, so it's a new week and time for some good workout. And today we are using a chair. So hope you have it. Just make sure that it's steady enough to bring your weight on the chair like this. That's pretty much all you need to know and also make sure that it's not on a um, surface that is too slippery so it won't slide underneath you. Then you can take a bottle of water and a towel and we are ready to go. We're gonna start with a small uh, short warm-up and then we're gonna go to the actual workout part. All right, so one more time, welcome, let's go. So open your legs, relax your shoulders a little, take a deep breath in, out, one more time, inhale, very good. All right, bring your hands down, roll the shoulders back. Four, three, two, bigger arms. And four, three, Two, bring your hands down, swing your arms up and down. Relax the shoulders. Yes. Very relaxed movement. Get rid of with all the tension you might have in the shoulders or shoulder blades. Now bring your hands in front of the chest and rotate side to side. You can also straighten your arm and you can bring your hand 180 degrees back. Four, three, Two, come back in the middle and again swing double. And we have four more. Three, two, and last one. Now you're gonna stay down and press the shoulders down. All right, last two, come back in the middle, roll all the way up. And now, again, swing up and down. Now you can grab your chair from the front. Four more, three, two, last one. Now grab the chair from the side and come side to side. All right, come back in the middle and march. And you can go a little bit faster. You can lift your heels up. Very good, 15 seconds. Four more, three, two, Yes, all right. Stay down there. I'm just gonna turn to the side so you see a little bit better. Still, grab the chair from the side. Bring your toes on the floor and slowly dip your knees down and straighten your legs, straighten your back. Dip down and straight. Dip down and straight. One more time. All right, in tempo, here we go. Down and up, down and up. Yes, now we're gonna twist the knees to the side. Just change both sides right away. Beautiful. All right, we go eight more, eight more. And last four, three, two, one more. All right, stay up and jump. Now open your legs. And close, and open, close, open. Right 
Last eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Open your legs and bring your knee down. And other side. Yes, four more. Three, two, and we go a little faster. Down. Last four, three, two, yes. And bring your heels down and straight in your back. And stretch here for a while. Now turn to the side and stretch. Yes, come back in the middle. And again, straighten your legs, straighten your back. And you can turn to the other side and stretch. And come back in the middle. And you can roll all the way up. Wonderful. All right, so I hope you feel warm and ready for the actual workout part. So you can keep the chair that the back of the chair is away from you and the seating part is right on the front. We're gonna start with squats, but then we're gonna get up on the chair as well too. So bring your feet underneath your shoulders and slowly squat down. Wonderful, tempo. And down, and up. Yes, now we're gonna pull three. Go three, two, one. Come up. Three, two, one. And up. Three, two, one. And up. Three, two, one. Pulls eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Don't go up, stay down in the squat position. And four, three, two, come up. Yes, tap the chair. If you want, you can bring your arms up and down. 15 seconds. And last eight. Four, three, two, yes. All right, so now you can bring your right foot on the chair. You can crap the back of the chair with your hands. Bring your foot kind to the middle and come up to the chair, tap, and down. And down, two more slowly, up, and down. One more time. Tempo, here we go. Yes, very good. Now stay up. We're going to step to the side and come up. Step to the side and up. One more time slowly. And tempo. And down and up. Down and up. Down and up. Four more. Three. Two. Now we're going to alternate. Bring the foot back to the chair, to the side, to the chair, down, chair, yes. Four more times. Two more. Last one. And now stay up. Side lift. Four, three, two, 
One more time. Now, pulls three. Three, two, one, and down. Three, two, one, and down. Three, two, one, and down. One more time. Three, two, one, and you can step down on the floor. Wonderful. Shake your legs a little so we can have one more round. We're going to start again with the squats. So here we go. Feet underneath the shoulders. Keep your back straight. Squat down. And one more time. Tempo. Down and up. And pulls three, three, two, one, up, three, two, one, and up. And pulls eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it. And four, three, two, and come up, yes. Again, shake your legs a little. And tap the chair. And if you want, again, take your hands with you. And last one, and now. Bring your left foot in the middle. Grab the chair. Bring your leg up and down. Up and down. Tempo. Four more. Three, two, and now we're gonna step down to the side. Come up, and up, and one more time, and tempo, here we go, down, and up, down, and up, and now step down to the side, to the back, to the side, to the back, beautiful. Four more. Three. Two. And last one. Yes, all right, side lift. Pulls three, two, one. Bring your leg down and up. Three, two, and down. Three, two, one more time. There we go. Three, two, and you can bring your foot down and shake your legs. Wonderful. So at this point, you can take a quick water. You can wipe your face a little, and then we're going to move on. All right, so let's work a little bit with the upper body. We're going to have some push-ups. If you want, you can turn the chair sideways. Yo. All right, so you can grab your chair from the side. Again, make sure that it's not sliding underneath you, that you don't drop on the floor. So. Find a good position that it's comfortable for you to do a push-up. Down, 
and up, down and up. You have two choices. You can either grab the chair from the side or you can place your palms on the sitting part of the chair. Tempo. And one more. All right, stay here. Mountain climbers, 30 seconds. Fifteen seconds. Four, three, two, and last one. Good. Come up. Take a little break. We're gonna repeat the same thing one more time. So we're gonna repeat the push-ups, and then one more time. Thirty seconds. Mountain climbers. All right, good. So, four push ups slowly. You can keep the slow pace as well if you don't want to do faster. Or if you want to go faster than eight times in tempo. But first, slow time, slow. And up. Down. And up. Beautiful. Down. And up. And tempo, let's go. And down, and up, down, and up, down, and up. Four more times. Four, three, two, one more. Yes, stay here and go. So mountain climbers, one more time, 30 seconds. Yes. Fifteen seconds left. Last four. Three. Two. And last one. Done. Yes. All right. So, you can roll the shoulders a little. Bring your hands front and back. So we're going to work still with the upper body but now with the triceps. So this time we're gonna actually sit on the chair. Good, so you're gonna sit to the front side. Grab the chair from the side, kind of near the front corners. And again, make sure that the chair is secure, that it's not gonna flip over. And slowly down, and up, and down, and up, yes. Tempo, down, up, down, up. And last one. Good. Now, sit on the chair, shake your hands a little. Now we're going to grab the chair from the side. And the goal is, is to straighten your arm and lift your lower back up so you are hanging between your arms. All right. So, again, you need to find a good position that you are able to do it. So, here we go. Hold it. Four, three, two, and sit down. Oh, <laughs> yes, a lot harder than it looks like, right? <laughs> if you were just watching, please try it. <laughs> All right, so we're going to repeat again the whole block. We're going to have some tricep dips. Remember, the movement is in the elbow all the time. So it's not only going pelvis up and down. Hands are working. All right, we're gonna start again with slow tricep dips. Here we go. And down, up, down, 
and up. Tempo. Here we go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more time. Come up. Good. So we're going to do the hanging exercise one more time for 15 seconds. You can keep your knees bended or if you want more challenge, you can straighten your legs. Here we go. Hold it. <laughs> and if you want, straighten your legs. Four, three, two. Last one. And sit down. Ooh, yes. So you can roll your wrists a little. You can bring your hands behind your back. All right, we're gonna stay still on the floor, uh, on the chair, sorry. And we have some core exercises. So you just sit on the chair, bring your hands behind your back. We're gonna start by lifting the feet up. And you can add rotation, bring your opposite elbow to the opposite knee. If you want, you can bring your heels all the time on the floor or you can keep them elevated from the floor all the time. Four, three, two, tempo. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and bring your feet down. Very good. We're still gonna stay on the chair. Now you can grab the chair from behind. You can lean back a little. Bring your knees up and push to the front. Yes. And now twist side to side, right, left, right, left, four more, three, two, last one, small break, remember to breathe in and breathe out. So grab the chair again from behind you. Lean back, keep your legs straight, and thrust. Cross, open, cross, cross, open, cross, cross, open. And only cross, just cross, cross, cross. Last eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, last one, and done. Very good. All right, so we're gonna move on. Now you can take a mat, um, a mat or a towel with you. We're gonna bring it in front of the chair, and if you want, you can take a little drink as well. Good. So actually, this next exercise, if you want, you can completely do it on the floor in the plank position as well. You don't have to use the chair if you don't want to or you feel like it's a little bit too much. Let me show you in a second. Yes, all right. So first I will show you the option with the chair and after that I will show you the option without the chair. So bring your hands underneath the shoulders or underneath the um, yeah, shoulders. Bring your toes on the chair. Keep the plank position 
and we're going to start by bringing the knee underneath the shoulders. So we're going to start from that. But if you don't want to use the chair, you can completely bring your feet on the floor and do the exercise in the plank position. All right? Did you choose? All right. I'm going to bring the feet on the chair. Here we go. In. In. Yes. Four more. Three. Two. Last one. And now bring your knees out. 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 Four more. Three. Two. Last one. All right. And you can bring your knees on the floor. Woo. <laughs> Good. So we're going to do this one more time. So either you can stay on the floor or you can bring the toes on the chair. We're going to start the same way. Bring the knees underneath the shoulder, uh, underneath the chest. But the next round, we were bringing the knees outside. Now you're going to bring the knee through to the opposite elbow. All right. Here we go. Four, three, two. And bring your knees in. In. Four, three, two. And now bring your elbow through to the opposite. Uh, knee to the opposite elbow. <laughs> Four more. Three, two, last one. Yes. And again, bring your knees on the floor. And you can bring your hands behind your back. Mm. Very good. All right. So now we're going to stay on the floor. Turn around. And then you can bring your chair a little bit closer to you. Yes. All right. So bring your elbows on the floor. Take a nice and comfortable position. And now bring both of your feet to the side of the chair. And we're going to roll them over to the other side. Beautiful. A little bit faster. Fifteen seconds. Even faster. And last one. Yes. <laughs> All right. Now you can bring your head down on the floor. You can bring your hands behind your head. Bring your heels on the chair. And crunch up. And now bring your knee in and in. In. And now you can bring the elbow to the opposite knee. And even faster. And last eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one and down. You can bring your head down on the floor. Grab your knees. Bring your lower back up and down. 
and you can swing all the way up. Yes, well done. We're gonna finish this chair workout today with some cardio exercises. So, you can take your mat away. And you can take a chair if you want. You can take a drink. So, as a final push, just cardio. We have a few different cardio exercises that we go through, and after that, we're gonna stretch and relax a few minutes, and after that, we are done. So, the last minutes. Let's go. Good. So, again, place your uh, chair that the back of the chair is facing away from you. And again, grab your chair from the side. And we're gonna start just with a jump. Here we go, jump it up. And now, open your legs. And close open. And close your legs and run. Run, 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 run. Yes, yes, yes. Lift the heels up, heels up. Fifteen seconds left. Fifteen. Just keep running. There it is. There it is. Last four. Three. Two. And last one. Take fifteen second break. And then we're gonna finish with a thirty second mountain climber. So as you were now lifting the heels up, now come a little bit deeper in to the plank position and go. 30 seconds. Yes. Keep going. Remember to freeze. We have 15 seconds, 15 seconds. Four. Three, two, one, and done. Yes, all right. So that was the workout part for today's chair workout class. And now the rest of the class, few minutes, we're gonna stretch a little bit. So I'm gonna change the music. You can grab a drink, you can grab your chair, and you can already sit down. So, good job, workout done, week started, I hope you have had a great start for the week. So, you can sit down, take a nice comfortable position, but in a way that you are able to keep your back straight. You can drop your shoulders down. You can bring your hands over your knees. All right. And now just breathe in. But you can still keep your hands over your knees. Shoulders relaxed. One more time. Good. Now rotate to the right, bring your opposite arm to the side of the knee that you feel a little bit pressure in the shoulder plate. If you want, you can come even deeper to the further. Four, three, two, and change other direction.
and come back in the middle. Now you can sit a little bit more front and reach over to the other side. And change. And now come back in the middle. Bring your elbows to the front of the knees and push your legs open. And four, three, two, and roll up. You can close your legs and you can come over your feet. You can take a chair to the side and grab the back part of the chair, grab your ankle. And now you can release your ankle and now bring the other leg back, knee close to the floor. You can straighten your legs. And slowly roll up and bring the chair to the other side. And again, you can grab your chair, grab your ankle and stretch. And you can release the ankle and now bring your other leg again behind you. And straighten your leg. your feet together and you can bring your hands behind your back and you can release your hands shake your legs shake your shoulders bring your feet underneath your shoulders one more time and breathe in and out, and one more time, deep breath in, and out, and you can bring your shoulders back, and legs together, wonderful job, that was your Monday evening's chair workout, so thank you very much that you were with me tonight, I want to wish you a nice evening, a wonderful week, and in 15 minutes, we're going to start one more uh, easy jazz for the Monday morning, so you are very welcome to join that as well. Otherwisely, stay healthy, and we will see you soon. Good night. <laughs>